complex fractions. For section overview, simple fractions and complex fractions. Converting complex fractions to simple fractions. Hi, it's Nori Harmony. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we have another episode for our series Math D by Complex Fractions. Now without further ado, let's start. Complex fractions. For section overview, simple fractions and complex fractions. Converting complex fractions to simple fractions. For a simple fraction, a simple fraction is any fraction which the numerator is any whole number and the denominator is non-zero whole number. So for example, is one half and four over 3, 4 thirds, and 763 over 1,000. So basically, yung nasa baba ay whole number. And nasa baba, whole number din, hindi siya zero number. So simple lang siya na fractions. Next, complex fraction is a complex fraction is any fraction in which numerator and or the denominator is a fraction. It is a fraction of fraction. Some examples of complex fractions are this. So complex fractions I fraction sha made of the lawang fractions. A numerator natin three fourths and a denominator natin five six. And 1 third uh, over 2, 6, 9 over 10, and 4 plus 8, uh, 4 plus 3 eighths, and 7 minus 5, 6. Ito yung complex fractions. Now, converting complex fractions to simple fractions. So, for example, ang gagawin natin sa pag-convert ng complex fractions to simple fraction ay i-divide natin siya. So, ganito siya. 3, 8 and 16, 15. Nilipat natin yung 16 sa taas dahil i-divide nga natin siya. So, di ba ganun? I yung nasa yung denominator, ilipat na i-factor muna natin siya bago natin i-times. So, anong pwedeng i-time, ah, uh, i-divide sa 8 and 16? So, we all know, pwede ang 8 divided by 8 is equals to 1. And 8 divided by 16, or 16 divided by 8 is equals to 2. And sa, sa 3 and 15, pwede natin siyang divide both sa 3. So, 1, 3 divided by 15 is equals to 5. So, our new fractions is 1 over 1 times 2 over 5. So, 1 times 2, pwede na tayo mag-multiply ngayon. It's equals to 2 and... 1 times 5 is equals to 5. So, our final answer is 2 fifths. So, ang, sim ang simplified version ng fraction, na complex fraction na ito, ay 2 fifths. Example for complex fraction is this. 5 plus 2 fifths over 3 plus 3 fifths. Now, bago natin siya i-divide, i-convert muna natin ito. So, ganito lang siya. 5 times 5 is equal to 25 plus 2. So, 27 over 5. And 3 ta uh, 5 times 3 is equal to 15 plus 3 is equal to 18 over 5. Kinapi lang natin yung denominator. So, ngayon, pwede na tayong mag-divide. 27 over 5. Tapos, ilipat natin yung 5 sa taas. So, maging 5 over 18. Yan. 
So, factor muna tayo. Pwede pa to. So, naging 1 divided by 5 siya. Eighteen and twenty-seven. Pwede silang divided by nine. Ito magiging two. At ito magiging three. So, our new, our new fractions are this. Three is over one times one over two. Three times one, three. One times two equals two. Our final answer is two. So, a simplified version of these complex fractions is this. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope I could share something to you. And if you like this video, please kindly click the like button and subscribe to this channel and share this to your friends. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.